the people. It does actually take two, but this is just one of the games I apparently with the mod pack I'm using. You can't actually, um, like when you create a world, you have to close out the game and then you can load in. So, yeah. Also, yeah, this is the Diamond Dimensions mod pack. You may have heard of it from Dante DM. And this is ver a version 1.12 mod pack. And as you know, we are in version 1.17, so this is a few versions ago. Yeah. Roughly five versions ago, and... So, yeah. But, today we're just going to be playing around with the mod pack. My swamp, and... I think this is... That's not... I think I'm actually gonna remove this from inventory. But this, I believe, is from the Farlander squad. Oh, right, this is. <laughs> yeah. Also, uh. One second, since I'm still getting used to controls, I actually don't know all the controls. Those controls might change from version to version. Um. Which one is Wait, where is it? Where is the change perspective? Uh, F5. You can see my uh, skin here. I made it myself in like 30 minutes, so don't judge the quality of it, okay? Also, you can. Yeah, first time you load, open up that, I believe it's actually just an aversion. It, uh, yeah. You can see this, I believe each, um, one of these squares, I, mean, I think you could see my cursor, if not, then yeah. But each one of these squares is a chunk, I'm pretty sure. For sure, each one of those squares is 16 by 16 area. It's like... You know, it's kind of annoying. It both it both is annoying and makes sense that I can't um, use a controller. Jeez, if you can make it to the top of one of these towers, you can get... Quite a bit, oh my god. So you have to triple click. click. It sounds a little crazy. Yeah, just after this, I'm probably gonna record my. I'm sorry, record my survival. Oh, 
Huh, this is where he's not throwing all the advancements. But yeah. Now, advancements unlike achievements. Well, first things first, with cheats enabled. Um. They, they don't get disabled. But another thing is, is that they actually unlock things. And the game diamonds actually unlocks the crafting recipe for an enchantment table. I hear the far line. Uh, 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 now, what have the Optifine mod, except for as I said before, I can't install individual mods. Sadly. Uh, 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 oh. Just, this is my first experience being able to properly mod the game. But the thing that sucks is that I still do have a hard time controlling on PC. Even not as bad as when I first started making consistent videos because, you know, for six months I was using just the PC controls, but yeah. Oh okay, yeah, I was gonna check to see if my way of making the Twilight Forest portal was correct. I can remember what plans the inventory is like. I think we could just shift. Yeah, I could just shift click on my way. Where you didn't work. Hold on, guys, I'll be right back. <laughs> I think it just takes vanilla, vanilla, vanilla blocks. I think it takes poppy. I accidentally threw the poppy. Whoops. It takes water bucket. I might take dandelions, I'm not sure. Yeah, and what I would do is I would just...
First time. Yeah, I, I just don't know. It's just something similar to that. Oh, definitely. Like, okay, before I actually do a mod playthrough, I do want to do mod reveal reviews, and I would. Of, of these mods individually because you know that's fine because you know you see this also by the way I, I believe this over here is a mod on its own So now this is working. Oh, okay. Oh wait, how do you get obsidian? Hmm. It's also these, which are... Yeah. I believe these two are their, are the same mod. These are like the edible swords, and this is... The same swords. I'm assuming you take... The Dragon Killer Hilt and Dragon Killer Blade. Craft them together, get the Dragon Killer, which... Is, uh... Oh, with the auras that take these, the hilt which takes this, which takes that, which is non-craftable, but in that formation, and then takes this, which is a, one of these special sticks that take that. Okay, yeah, that's... It really just depends on how much D this is. And this, I, yeah, this isn't craftable. And um, let's turn on uh, cheat mode. Just so I can grab up the portal here. Actually not, I don't actually don't think this is the portal that's used to get into it. Like what is this? I'll kill you, I'll kill you with the portals. Also, there's the mod that shows you how much health they have. I forget what it's called. The other mod with the most armor, by the way, is the Twilight Forest. Oh, hey, there's spawners for a lot of the bosses. Okay, what are. Seriously, though, what are these portals used for? These are doors. 
in this corridor. Maybe that's what I'm gonna travel. So I can assume that these saplings you probably get from the trees in the twilight forest. And this is actually the same recipe as the book and quill, but it has the bat sapling. And then this is just the book and quill and and a, a couple of saplings. I can imagine that this over here will be useful. But yeah, this uh, this is just to show I can mod. I mean, yeah. I'm gonna do some more off-cam experimenting before I actually do anything with the modding. Hey, what's this? Oh, this is not one of these, isn't it? Yeah. Hey okay, guys, uh, this will be the end of the video. Till next time, stay out of this world.